All right, we'll take two on this. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to uh, PS4 Library. Uh, this one is Plague Road. Uh, I did get a new capture card, and uh, starting a new game will overwrite. Yep. Uh, I did get a new capture card because my old one actually crapped out on me, which kind of sucked. Uh, so... All the farther I got into it was after this, we realized I was really echoey on the new capture card, so we stopped. I know, I am talking over the... Welcome to Plague Road. To control the doctor, use the left stick. I know I am talking over uh, the audio. So, this is a survivor. Approach them and press the button indicated to let them know it's safe to flee. A survivor is rescued. So, I know nothing about this game. Uh, clearly, what I thought of as this game was wrong, I thought this would be a turn-based roguelite game. And uh, it is not. Uh, there is a wolf ahead touching an enemy gin begins a combat encounter. Fight the wolf to proceed. Oh, maybe it is. To battle! Oh, yeah. Okay. It is turn-based. Uh, how do I execute? There's no... There's no, like, routing or anything? Along the road, you'll find... Uh, objects to inspect, like this chest. A prompt will appear when you can interact with an object. Open the chest. Stamina potions. Okay. You have found a potion. You can use potions by opening the menu or with the item command while in combat. Green arrow. Exits from a room are indicated with arrows. Many rooms have multiple Exits. You can keep track of where you are with the minimap. People arrows, or purple arrows, will require you to collect herbs from fallen enemies before being allowed to progress. Oh my god. Hector. Whoa there, friend. Hector's the name. What are, what are you doing way out here? I have urgent business in the city. I'd imagine you do. There's a lot of business for a doctor in the city right now. A lot of suffering. But it's not safe to be in these woods alone. Not anymore. And certainly not with such a poor firearm. You should turn back. Stand aside, gunsmith. I have no time for your sales pitch. Suit yourself, but don't say I didn't warn you. I'm not go I'm not going to stop you. Ah! Could you stop me? Clearly this thing is scary. <laughs> not scary. I am going to die. like first hit where am I an abandoned farm just off the road to the city I bought you brought you here after you didn't listen to me and those monsters nearly killed you I suppose I should be grateful you're welcome it doesn't look like anyone has lived here in a long while 
in a long time, seems like a good place to take shelter. If you're determined to travel to the city, you could pay the kindness forward. There are a lot of people on the road looking for a safe place. What about you? Oh, I'm not one for settling down, but maybe we'll meet again on the road. We could do something about that uh, pea shooter you're holding. Be seeing you. This is the farm where the doctor can send lost survivors and make preparations to travel the road. As more survivors come to the farm, it will grow and provide many rewards to aid the doctor's journey. By selecting the hunting lodge, you can get information on the next available reward. When you're ready to travel down the road, select the expedition menu. Train doctor? A sign? Okay. The planes or the... F okay, I have to go to the planes. Ah, you startled me. You shouldn't speak, sneak up on people when they're so obviously busy. You are obviously busy? Obviously. As I was fleeing from the nasty business back in the city, I was hit upon by a most splendid idea. What if there were an automated system that could carry people across great distances? It would certainly be in a... Uh, more effective than walking or depending on animals. True. That does sound useful, but this seems like a rather dangerous place to just stand around. There is a farm back down the road where a lot of city dwellers are finding refuge. Delightful. Yes, yes. But first, I really want to finish the, this line of thought. Once I have an idea, I can't focus on anything until I figure out how it works. You know what would help? Another engineer to bounce thoughts off of. Oh, and a commoner, someone who uh, thinks the way normal people think. I just can't crack it. If only I had an engineer and a peasant to talk to. I know this thing can work. Okay, then. I wonder if the background talking made any, uh, made it in. I don't think this is... Okay, maybe I should have gone up to it first. Oh, come on. Go into this corner. This corner? Oh, 
Oh my god, I can move so far. Oh, that's not going to help me. I'm dead. All right, I am a little more than a little confused on what's actually supposed to be happening. Few survivors, zero of 20 survivors. How exactly do I train? Oh, it is snowing quite significantly. This is a good time. Here, it's a, it is a good thing we went out earlier. A survivor is rescued. A survivor is re Oh, I see. There were actually more than one survivor. I have no idea what the wind condition is for this. It's going to attack me. It's going to kill me in one hit. Oh, apparently not. I feel like I definitely need a few survivors to even do anything. So, a peasant, a nurse, and a soldier. Oh, I could actually add these into my party, can't I? Maybe? Let's add the nurse in? Oh, I could add more than... How many could... Could I have just four? I don't have the people you need, my guy. I do not know what the what the point of this game is.
Oh, he's frozen. Weird. Let's see. Oh, the farmer is the one that's low. He's the only one I could get to. So we'll go over here with you. We'll actually shoot the one that could move. This is probably a terrible waste of turn economy. But we will figure this out just with uh, further games of this. A scarecrow? Looks very scary. Oh my god. He actually did quite a lot of damage. Oh, I should have done the wolf. You got snow all over you, baby girl. Yep, don't shoot. Stab him. Wait, there was a... Why did I get a... Okay. Yes. That doesn't change my answer. Oh my god, it just did. Oh. So, the doctor needs healed.
Oh, come on, Scarecrow. Let's see. 116. Yeah. I believe if the doctor dies, I die too. Or I go back. So the arrows actually mean nothing on map. Don't shoot him. Does the doctor's stamina not reheal? Or does it just heal turn over turn? They are actually just slightly faster than me. No, oh, why did I do that? Ah, dang it. I was just inside of its run animation. My wife just asked why the farmer looks like me. I do not believe the farmer looks anything like me. Oh, that's terrible. Better question is why does the farmer have, have, uh, Iron armor on. Okay, so there's another peasant. A uh, peasant? Oh, I see him.
Jab him! Oh, he didn't die. No, I'm fighting bandits. The trees just look terrifying. They're not really doing anything. Am I stuck somewhere? Or is that the end of this? I don't quite know how the stages work in this game. Oh, there was there was more to this stage. Oh, I think my peasant might be dead. Let's see, 147. Take that, Bandit. Let's see. Anybody down anything? Yes, the peasant is. Just barely. All right, push me. Suppose I should actually come up here and try and take this guy out. Hmm. Oh, babe. Oh, don't. Don't hit my healer. I'm taking it to you. You know, I probably should have moved her.
I don't know how much they care. So, my wife wants to inform you all that we took our dog, Annabelle, to get a pop cop. For those of you who do not know, there are some, uh, like, restaurants or fast food places that, uh, that give out, like, cups filled with, uh, with whipped cream to give to your doggy. And Annabelle loves them. Yeah, lose your turn. Again, why would you try for my healer? Well, yeah, but... It's always rule of thumb that you kill the healer first, but it's never nice when you do it to the party. Oh my god, don't do that. So, it's important to take out the bandit. Don't, don't attack my peasant. Not like that. Good, actually attack the soldier that way. It's not wasted healing on anyone. Do I need to ask? What is corn juice? Oop, don't shoot it.
figures that your corn juice isn't worth anything. <laughs> Why would you kick me? Is it because you're trying to sell corn juice to people? I was behind a tree. How the heck did you hit me? I just wasted that. Absolutely wasted that. So I don't think that second, that third dog could actually attack any of us. You really are concerning me, that is. Alright, so my peasant needs the most healing. Ah, yes, got him. It seems like a personal problem. Yep. It's just a guaranteed iridium quality? Holy crap. Annabelle's looking at you like, I don't believe you. Peasant could use. Looks like everybody else is full of healed. Nope, oh, nope. I could also use some healing. Oh my god, he has 2 HP left.
God, how many survivors are there? Yes, shoot the soldier. Nope, not shoot. I probably should shoot. Okay, so two hundred, two twenty five. Let's just take one out. So, I... Not gonna lie, I actually kind of enjoy my team layout right now. I don't know if there are certain survivors that are, you know, like, hard-coded to be. Like, how big my chances were of getting the layout I have in the first section. I'm assuming that there are going to be significantly better ones as we progress. I did say that weird. Okay, you are going to back up. You're going to come forward. Um... So, if you die in this one, you go back to the farm. I think all of the people that you have will die, die. Like, will not come back. No, I want to stay up here, because... Oh man, I can't get to him. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that everything uh, that dies on a mission is dead dead.
Okay. Yep, soldier is the best to heal right now. Oh, I didn't even fully heal him. I'm actually going to wait. You are going to heal yourself. You are going to... No, you could actually come up and attack. And then you are going to wait. You're going to wait one more turn. You're going to get a heal off on you. And now, farmer, you are going to kill it. Trying to get more turn economy. So I don't die immediately. Look at him run away. Oh no, this is not good. I'll just go between them. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Am I right? Oh, definitely not strong enough. I do need to remember that uh, I am damaged. actually want to go here and then I will ice thrower you that way you're stuck there we'll take out this Get myself healed. Oh, I could have gone. Nope, never mind. How big are these maps? It's actually quite a lot uh, larger than I was expecting this to be.
Okay, the wolf's gonna go. We'll stop him. And we'll get up here and take out this guy. Man, there. So far, there isn't really a lot going on that I could talk about. I'm just going to get some turn economy. So, I can talk about that, or it could just be a surprise after this. Well, it depends on how long this game takes. This game may take a few. It's not... It's not a long game by any stretch of the imagination, but, uh, you know, the website that I consult for for games, howlongtobeat.com, says that this is a 10-hour game. Mr. Peasant, you need some healing. Scarecrow, why are you one of the smarter enemies? He just stays and attacks the same guy over and over. Everybody else runs around and does other things. Oh, banana. All right, who needs healing? 200. Soldier, you're lowest. Health potions, stamina potions. I finally got a chest to open. You know, I should move first. That way I'm just not going to get wolfed.
So I do like the aesthetic of this game quite a lot. It's a uh, nice sort of Victorian uh, esque, not quite steampunky, but I don't know. I always associate Victorian anyway with steampunk. Everybody's healed. Okay, so there's nothing off to the right. Oh yeah, you're backing up. Back it up real good. Only thing I wish would be better is that the nurse's HP would be higher. I'm assuming there's going to be different uh, sections that are possible. The other guy's frozen. I right, guess this. To use the train station for fast travel, the train must be unlocked in the farm. What is this guy? Hail, Doctor. Sir Edwin. And to you, Sir Knight. Are you headed into the city? I am, indeed. I shudder to think about what you will find there. When things started to go wrong, my regiment had been ordered to the city center to quell a disturbance. It was chaos. People were tearing each other apart. Some of them barely looked human in their rage. We didn't realize that something had changed them. Until it started changing some of us, in the end, any of my troops that made it out of there only did so by fleeing. They are likely scattered everywhere. There is a farm back down the road where survivors have been gathering. If if any are your f uh, former soldiers, you might reunite there. That sounds like an I 
ideal place to regroup. Unfortunately, my f uh, flight armor was damaged and I was uh, forced to land here in the forest. Now, I can't even take it off. I'm barely able to move in this. Without help from a person skilled with tools and a trained soldier, I can't go anywhere. Without help from a person's... Why... Why'd you double up? Seems a little weird. Alright. What the heck is this now? Area is unlocked. Oh, so this is actually a new area then, eh? I really don't think you guys can actually hear that. So, uh, there is... In every new section you go to, it sounds like, there's a guy that uh, speaks a riddle. Or, not a riddle, sorry, a rhyme. All right, nurse, I I trust you could Ooh. Okay. But yes, I trust you can uh heal yourself, nurse. I'm just going to wait, get some turn economy. No, oh, what am I doing? Dang it. I forgot to heal the uh, plague doctor. Oh, there are four of them. Oh, this is going to be bad, isn't it? I feel like I'm going to accidentally die here. Need to come over and get some 
frozen on an actual enemy. I'm stuck in here. That's one down. One less enemy turn economy. Peasant's good. Doctor needs some. And the soldier needs some. It's, they're going to attack the soldier, likely. Or most likely. I don't know why I assumed we would be able to take out the scarecrow. Wait, he thawed? Scarecrow needs to die. Two left. Getting everybody all healed up. You're like 80. I think we're good. So these areas are clearly much uh, just a little bit stronger, not much stronger. Wait, this was the only area? Oh my god. There's a lot of powerful enemies here.
Let's see which one. Okay. We'll freeze the one that could shoot. Take some damage. Try and take out the scarecrow. Oh no, the doctor's almost dead. Oh, it's a good thing you can't attack through. Yes, I am going right into the center of cover. Just please don't shoot me. That's fine. Okay, we'll get a line going here. Freeze that guy. We'll just shoot. And then the farmer will go over, take him out. Alright, who's one... F oh, it's clearly me is the lowest... Oh, you're attacking the peasant again? Okay, peasant is lowest now. Have some healing. We're letting him spend all of his turn work. We need healing. If we're to last in this area. Or find where the next area is. Specific. It's a good thing the soldier has an infinite. Uh, ability to. Uh, regain stamina. Jeez. I believe it, this is going to kill it. Yep. All right, what do you have? A doctor, no one has called for you here. No, I am bound for the city. I see. 
Try though we did, those of my order could do nothing to reverse the sickness overtaking that place. Leonor, perhaps the mercies you provide would be of better use there. You should follow the road further back. There is a farm there where survivors have gathered. If we're suggesting places in need of our prospective services... My oath prevents me from abandoning a patient. This man is in no condition to travel, and it requires most of my concentration just to keep him that way. Without some help from two others of the order, I will have to remain here indefinitely. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must return to my prayers. My patient remains stable, doctor. If you want to help me, bring two of nurses. Why does it have to be two and not one? Chest. I'm a little bit frightened of this uh, giant hulking tree thing. Not gonna lie here. So, you're getting frozen. Oh, it's a golem. Alright, who needs healing? It's just the soldier as of right now. Nothing, nothing. Here we go. Soldier. You're the only one that needs anything. Alright, so how do I go about, like, buying weapons and stuff? Two health potions. Oh, too bad. I noticed I noticed uh before that there was a glitch that uh uh that some oh god he had me a little worried there was a glitch 
that uh, sometimes you could uh, get them to continually run towards the end of the map. Come on, take out. Take out as much of the Scarecrow as you can. I wish I could shoot and then move. That's the ideal circumstance. Yeah, let's try and shoot him. Ah, still not enough. That scarecrow's gone, at least. Come on, soldier. Peasant's a little low in HP. Not, not for turn economy. I want some heals in. Whatever heals I could get. I like his mask. Party inventory is full. Oh, that was pointless. Oh, that was even more pointless.
so I really do wonder if there's a way to get like super powerful in this game. He just stabbed me. Oh no. Oh no. I didn't have enough movement to actually freeze the guy. Got to try and take out the bandit. Not quite. Shooting should be good enough. Yep. This thing's so strong, it, it'll take me a while to get through them anyway. Alright, who needs... You're the last one that needs any healing. Oh, I'm, I missed that. Okay. Dang it. All right, is the tree going to be able to get, nope, it's not going to be able to get to me. It could only really move like two squares.
Come on, Golem. Oh, don't shoot the nurse. This is the worst thing you could do. Step one, one step back, just so I constantly get the, uh, 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 shot off and just smash through. Okay, this one I don't know how we're going to get through. Because there are way too many. It's going to do like 80 damage each. Ooh, more than that. My peasant is dead. There's no way my peasant isn't dead. How is he alive? Oh, that's not going to help too much, is it? Twenty two is most important. Otherwise, he will die. There's still a, a high likelihood he will die. Yeah, if the golem attacks, and the golem's attacking him. And that's with me keeping this other golem uh, indisposed. Oh, not the nurse. I might be able to get this if I could just be able to waste enough turns.
For the love of God, keep the golem. Oop, not shoot. Okay, I think we got this. Or not. Maybe not. If he... Oh, thank God. You're going to be the last one I'm getting. Thank you for taking out my soldier be right before you kill me. Okay. I think that was a pretty effective first section let's view the survivors who an engineer a soldier a witch a double witch a nurse a witch. Come on, second nurse. Oh, there we go. What the heck is the cost? Okay, what is the hunt? Do I need to retire the survivors to get... Uh... Health... Speed. Ooh, okay. I'm I'm seeing you have like no movement, engineer. I really liked how, ooh, that's a flamethrower. We need the nurse, so we'll get rid of two witches. One soldier. Oh, okay. I see how the progression is. Let's get a peasant. 
throw the witch in there, and we'll throw the soldier in, because I want the engineer. Oh, wait a minute. I need a soldier. So I need an engineer, a peasant, and a soldier. That was a requirement for one of the objectives. Just need to find the guy. Oh, he's right here. There is an engineer and a peasant traveling with me. Can they help? Marvelous. Oh, this is terribly exciting. The three of us. Why, we'll change the world. I thought I, I thought we legit like broke there. Machine room available and train available. I'm going to run back to the farm just to My game just crashed. Well, that sucks. I guess it's good to know that... Continue game. That it is somewhat unstable. All right, what did we get? Machine room. So I still want the peasant, the soldier, the engineer. And the witch, because I, I need two nurses. So I could go straight to the forest. I don't actually think that that's the best idea, now that I'm thinking about it. What do you need? I found I've found a soldier and engineer who might be able to help you. At last, soldier fall in. Help that tinkerer fix the bucket of bolts so I could get out of here. Keep is available. Yours or mine? Why, did you get a good... Yep. And they're all iridium. Oh, wow. So, my wife is playing uh, Stardew Valley. And uh, she got her forging as high up as it would go and and she had a farm that was entirely based around pigs or mo sorry not entirely mostly built around pigs and uh her farm is uh now getting entirely iridium quality uh Uh, uh, forage. So, whenever pigs dig something up, it's iridium quality. So she's making a crap ton of money.
God, I hate the look of this peasant. I much preferred the other one. Wow, the flamethrower does a crap ton of damage. I like it. Now let's actually see what you do. What is the death now? Oh, it's just high damage attack. Oh, not quite. I was really hoping to get it out of the way. Guarantee him out of the fight. I'm going to go left here. It worked. Don't shoot my engineer. What are you, a peasant? Okay, my witch is about dead. All right, is he going to kill something? Nope. Oh my god, my peasant's just never going to be able to attack, is he? Oh, HP just never recovers? That's good to know. I really desperately need uh, nurses for every encounter then.
All right, so I should have had enough to fully recover uh, every possible person I've lost. Why would you move there, of all places? Oh, to stab me. Uh, that makes sense. Hi again. Two nurses. And that's, you know, assuming I could ever find you again. I somehow managed to go right back to, uh... to uh, the farm. Delightful. Ooh, what's this little symbol? I don't know what that symbol means. Flame. So, oh, I'm seeing what what will happen. If I get enough, I could actually... Oh, that's what that symbol is. Retire bonus times two. It must be a leveled up soldier or something. We'll do that. We'll bring the nurse along. Second soldier. Flame, ice, which engineer is better? It doesn't matter. I saw a survivor there, so... What does poison do?
We need to keep the golem frozen. All right. I got to say, I'm really, really hating the poison blast. It does such low damage. So it's looking like this soldier also has infinite uh, possibilities. Oh yeah, it would be great to have the uh, pizza ordered. I want to actually move down so I can slash at you. Golem, you're staying. You're staying frozen forever. Reduce their action economy. I don't think that this is going to duplicate or double. Okay, full, full, close, close. Wait, how is it not dead? Oh, it was at 5 HP. I thought it hit it to exactly zero. Well, which one are you? Are you... Oh, you're the high value one. Dang it. Where did I have you move forward? Might as well move forward just so... The other guy has a target.
So you're the high value one. Will I be able to take out the Scarecrow? I think I should be able to. Just barely. It's going to die of poison now. All right, everybody's fully healed, except for the healer. Okay, there's a survivor. This nurse most definitely does not have the speed that my other nurse did. So you have almost a hundred health to heal. One ninety nine. Okay. Going for the nurse? Nope, not the nurse, the soldier. Still. I think the one running around in the back needs to be taken out.
Yeah, just keep attacking the engineer. Exactly what you want to keep doing. It's going to die by poison. Let's wait, wait on you. Last bit of healing, everybody's healed up except for the nurse. And now, wait, the poison ended? Okay. That's fine. Yes, you are. Okay, so you need to come up, ice thrower. I'll have you come up and get preemptive poison on the golem. You can stay exactly where you are. Get some wolf damage. Only one that's been attacked is you. I actually move you up. Get that slash in. Move you up. I just throw over the golem. Two hundred, three thirty, little bit damaged. Why do I keep on opening those? Did I run past? No, I didn't. But I am going to run past this guy. Give it some time. I wonder if he'll go away. No, he won't, but the other guy did. Oh, I actually need to move you Two up. 
Take that, Scarecrow. My god, he's the only one. Oh, I should have just shot him. Oh well. No, oh, don't use item. One V five. Oh, yeah. How bad do I want this to go? Thank you for attacking the engineer. And you're not attack. Oh my god. You just start to assume it at some point. And it's a good thing I'm wrong. Okay. So I am. Just so everyone is aware, I do need to go and pick up some pizza uh, in about 10 minutes or so. Uh, I'm trying to I'm trying to think exactly how long it's gonna take. It's probably gonna take about 30 minutes for me to get back. So thinking about it, I'm gonna I'm gonna end stream and end uh, the recording. Uh, but I will be, uh, I will be back to stream later on today, and I will be streaming 
well, until I go to bed, because uh, due to weather, we are not uh, doing our normal routine. Oh, seriously? Two is about down a hundred. The soldier's really low. Well, you kind of suck, so. This will kill him. He would not have died otherwise. Stay where you are. Get that poisonous blast going. God, this wolf has a ton of health. Are you going to stab me? Yeah. This should take out the Scarecrow. I was going to say I should be able to take him out. I need the survivor. Oh, this is a tough one. This guy needs to be locked down. But I'm sort of in range of two scarecrows right now. I need to go up just to uh, give other targets. Oh, I can't reach that scarecrow. Okay. Okay, you're the important one.
Yes. Okay, so... You will die if I do not heal you. So instead, I guess... Oh, never mind. Ha, huh, I did save him. Get them all poisoned. Yes, move. Oh, jeez. They just killed me. Okay, so if you take them with, even if they don't die, they no longer come back. Alright, well, anyway, like I said, I do need to go. Uh, we will be continuing the stream in about half an hour, give or take. Uh, but if you liked what you watched, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, follow, whatever platform you were on. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.